Thursday, everybody. Hope you're having a great Thursday so far. And that the rest of your Thursday is great too because you are amazing. And I finally figured out what day it is. It's Thursday. <laughs> I made a video yesterday. I was telling everybody happy Thursday, even though it was only Wednesday. Wishing my Wednesday away. But anyway, I'm driving to work this morning. I was thinking about how recently my son, Micah, and my daughter, Maya, were in the paper. It's hot in here. Uh, because they happened to be out ice skating on Collins Lake. And, and the uh, newspaper reporter came by. And so he was talk chatting with them and took their picture and put it in the Sky Gazette. And actually, uh, another paper in Niskuna. And people were sending me pictures of, hey, I saw your kids. And, and it was, it was kind of neat and fun that they were out there. And I got thinking about how they ended up, up out there. And, and largely, it's because... Um, Last year, during Christmas break, Maya was home from college, and she's like, Dad, let's go ice skating. And then, so I, I said, I don't know, where are we gonna go ice skating? I said, hey, let's go to Collins Lake. And Collins Lake at the time was frozen solid. There was not a lick of snow on it. It was like the most perfect ice in the world. And so we went out and checked the ice, and, and, and I checked it for safety, and talked to some other folks that were around, and we went out and had a great time ice skating. And then this year rolled around again, and and instead of me going out there with the kids and checking the ice and making sure it was safe, Maya went out and <laughs> checked the ice and made sure it was was safe and, and brought her brother out and they went out ice skating. And and all of that was a result of, of an activity that we started last year, which was a result of an activity I grew up with my entire life, which was skating on ponds and lakes and, and you know, uh, with my siblings and, and playing hockey and with, with uh, kids in my neighborhood. and and just having that knowledge that was given to me from my parents uh, that I passed down to my kids and now that now they own it and possess it. And I thought, what, it, what an interesting way it is to live life where we as parents, and I don't know about you, the rest of your parents, is a lot of times I, f I feel like I don't know what the heck I'm doing <laughs> so, as a parent and I'm just doing the best that I can. And, um, but we have this information that was given to us as our parent uh, from our parents and we pass it down to our kids and we teach them instead of what to think all the time and, and making every decision for them, we, we teach them how to think and how to be safe and how to mitigate risk, uh, not avoid it altogether, but how to, to assess risk and then how to take those things and to go enjoy and experience life. And, and when we do that, we teach them how to think instead of what to think, they're able to go and enjoy life on their own with you or without you but uh and i don't have to make every decision for them as they go through life and they can in turn now take the information and the experience and the knowledge that we passed on to them and and pass it on to others like maya was out there skating with micah um and then they can go and take those things and, and live a rich and satisfying life and and to me that's what it's all about and so i got thinking about that and i want to encourage everybody to to take those that information base or that knowledge base that you have and a lot of it came from your parents or it just came from living life and pass that on to your kids and teach them how to think uh and 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 they will that will free you up from having to make every decision for them and teach them how to be thinkers and uh risk mitigators and so they can go out and, and and have a rich and satisfying life and enjoy life themselves so i hope that helps you hope that it encourages you get out there today folks gain yards and all you do and please take care of your mindset because it matters i love you peace